Peggy 16. Where I'm from, history is impossible to escape. It's found where a shack once hosted a blues guitar prodigy in loamy cotton fields. It's in the remnants of industry and the great winding river itself. Life here has taught us resilience, but now our community is overwhelmed and we need your help. Help us prepare the next generation. Show them what a true hunter's made of. Why not cut your teeth stalking gray foxes in the pine forest? Or try flushing a flock of bobwhite quail out of the grasslands of the low country. We got a raccoon problem, requires some firepower. Or if you're in the mood for something a little more old school, try prehistoric. Our state reptile is the indomitable American alligator. Welcome to the place where I'm from. Welcome to the home of the blues and the soul of the Deep South. Mississippi Acres Preserve. What is up, everybody? How you doing today? As you all just saw, that is the new trailer for Mississippi Acres Preserve. Coming to Call of the Wild December 7th. Okay, but listen to this. And I am so, so excited for this. Not just because of the map, okay? Not just because of the map. Mississippi Acres Preserve, available to download and, be, and play from December 7th on Epic Game Store and Steam for Windows PC, PlayStation, and Xbox. You know what that means? We're having a simultaneous release. This is what I talked about the other day. If we have a simultaneous release, things will go better. Just my opinion. Yes, there might be some bugs. That happens with everything that comes out. But a simultaneous release. When was the last time Call of the Wild had a simultaneous release? Um, and I, I just cannot believe it because what is it? Silver Ridge, Rancho, and Tiara had to wait like two months after PC got it in order to play it and bring a video to you guys. And by then, the hype's gone. So that is awesome. I am so looking forward to this. That is two days from yesterday, so December the 7th, it's a Tuesday, when this map will be coming out. I cannot wait. This is going to be awesome. Though, I, believe me, I am still skeptical. EW, please prove me wrong. But I can't wait to see if they have delivered like they should. Um, it ought to be really interesting to see how the mechanics of like the raccoons work i'm sure you all saw that the raccoons will be able to climb into trash bins i'm curious to see how that works if it works smoothly or if it's going to be kind of buggy i don't know but let's go ahead and run through this these are the animals that you can find on the reserve gray fox bobwhite quails eastern wild turkey so those are actually the kinds of turkeys that i hunt i hunt eastern wild turkeys um Cottontail rabbits, uh, feral pigs, black bears, and white-tailed deer, as well as raccoons, and I'm sure y'all saw alligators. I don't know about y'all, but that's that part where the alligator just like roared, hissed, whatever it did on its that was so cool looking. Oh man, I cannot wait to see what these alligators do. I'm, it's going to be a new mechanic, and I'm actually really excited because it looks like, unlike for the past few reserves, we're getting two animals with completely different animations. Raccoons and gators are going to have animations unlike any other animal in this game. 
completely unique to this map. So I think we're getting, just going to make sure I'm counting right, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, we're getting nine species on this map. And I know some of them are reskins and such, but we have, I think, I don't know, I think these, are these going to be feral pigs, like the same on Tiaro, or are they going to be a little different? That's yet to be known, but I guess we'll figure that out. So we could either have six or seven new species. That is awesome. It's exactly what we needed, though I'm also hoping, I've seen some people talking about this, and I was wondering the same thing, EW has a tendency to reuse the same animal type in a map following where they introduced it. Um, we got turkeys on Silver Ridge Peaks, and we've had them in every map since. Um, what's another example? Um, oh, shoot. Uh, rabbits. We've had rabbits all over the place. Um, oh, shoot. What was the other example? Um, pheasants. On Rancho Del Arroyo, now we have Bob White Quail. They're going to have the same animations. So now we have... American alligators. Well, there are crocodiles in Africa, and it makes sense to release an Africa map in the summer. So, who knows? Maybe we'll be getting an Africa map with crocodiles on it in 2022. I don't know. Looking forward to that, but for now, I am really looking forward to this. Uh, guys, let me know down below what y'all think of this um also before i forget there is a new weapon the uh 22 hornet um so that's gonna be good for the small game i wonder it's probably gonna be like a class one to two maybe i don't know i'm curious to see but i hope you all enjoyed this video let me know what you think about this new reserve down below if you're excited just meh or really couldn't care less i'm excited but skeptical at the same time so yeah let me know what y'all think hope you all enjoyed this video and I will see you next time.